I like walking around ghetto places because a lot of ghetto places they have they have religious nuts where it's bad genes like if it's ghetto folks like if it's ghetto folks or folks who like to make tacos like they miss they distort religion and they would do something illegal <laughs> that violates the first amendment and start trying to watch and see if they could find Jesus <laughs> so they can get help and miss the first step of how dumb that they look <laughs> trying to fucking trying to find a diaper changer like a baby trying to interview folks to change their diaper <laughs> where, where they were where it's a profile where they can only do one thing with the limitations they have being half here soulless animals who have bad genes where they're bad soulless parents procreate at the wrong time and have a mistake that can't be capable can't get over ego around two or three like a normal person with a soul you know like think of a little white kid asking if the sky is blue because they understand the world is bigger than them as soon as they can talk where something soulless is struggling with ego issues as an adult that they're never going to get over so these things have bad genes and are always going to do something dumb and babyish like trying to think they're going to get baby mercy and then start getting bitter when the mercy don't come and miss the first step of how stupid they look getting angry because they miss that they're too weak to take care of themselves <laughs> so it ends right there their whole life is just a joke because they're too weak to even take care of themselves then they start getting mad that someone else isn't taking care of them you know so that mindset of like someone rioting and mad because of a bad court case because they don't know how to oh I got I got to urinate <laughs> I got diabetes I got urinate <laughs> but that whole mindset of them being mad because they don't know how to appeal stuff they don't know how to like make appeals or anything and they're mad because something happened they don't understand how the law works they're just mad and they start burning stuff down burning down even their own neighborhood and then the in lovers <laughs> you know like folks that they would call in lovers and like the Jim Crow era they start getting scared because they're thinking whoa if they do that to their own neighborhood what are they going to do to us <laughs> <laughs> if they're so crazy they burn down their own neighborhood what are they going to do to us <laughs> and then they start doing stuff like affirmative action which has ruined this country where it's not racism if you have an all minority production company like the dark minorities you know which I'm a dark not minority it's only 12% of the population it's not racism you're not going to have folks qualified enough to be a doctor qualified enough to, to be creative enough to make movies <laughs> to work to work cameras you're not going to have anyone qualified enough if it's only 12 percent of the population if you have an all minority production company you're just going to have a whole bunch of unqualified folks doing stuff and messing stuff up <laughs> that's not racism that's just common sense so when you just hire minorities and folks and gender and gender minority folks who are less capable and you just put them in charity case positions of course the country is all messed up it just ruins everything in this country and it's just a short-sighted mindset where these things are thinking these things are so mindless they're thinking i did want to get a job they don't care about society getting better or anything they're just they're just mindless things like things in a zoo that can't think above their ego because they're not a real person so <laughs> so there's they're scheming over these in lovers as they would call them in the jim crow era like weak whites who are just who just get scared that they're going to go monkey monkey around and go riot because again like i said if they would burn down their own neighborhood they're thinking what are they going to do to them <laughs> so they just start they just ruin the country by giving these low quality, low skilled, mindless things that couldn't get over ego at two or three and just started giving them opportunities to go mess stuff up. <laughs> it's like, look at this. <laughs> they just got scared because again, thinking what are they gonna do to us if they do that to their own neighborhood, if they're that crazy. But the point is, they're that crazy because it's a last ditch effort. Animal survivor mode is the end. It's not fight or flight. Animals fight to flight because they got in a position because they're so weaker than everything real. 
that they get cornered and they just start biting and going crazy because that's the end. <laughs> so when they're doing that, that's the end. You just stomp them. You just stomp them because this is the United States. It's about earning. So not having common sense like that has made this country a mess, but it can be fixed. Am I going to fix it? I'm not going to fix it. That's not my job. If you want it fixed, that should be your job.